excited. I'm going to be a USF bull. Oh my gosh. How do I, uh, how do I pick a major? How do I pick my classes? How do I, oh. I have so many questions. Oh, I know what to do. Like a good neighbor, I'm in the dean's office. Hello. Hi. I'm uh, Eric Eisenberg. I'm Dean of the College of Arts and Sciences. Let me be the first to welcome you to our university. Thank you, but I just feel really unprepared and I don't know what to expect from orientation. I have just a tool for you. Here, take this. It will tell you exactly what to do. What can I help you with? Thank you so much, Dean Eisenberg. It's my pleasure. Okay, where do I start? Well, first, you should learn about USF structure. Think of it as a bullseye, with you at the center. Moving toward the outside, we have your major. Then your department. School. College. And then the greater university system. Awesome! So what do I do now? After you register for orientation, you'll need to check out the College of Arts and Sciences website for incoming freshmen. This will tell you what you'll need to do to have a successful orientation. Here's a link to help you get there. Now, I have to pick a major, right? Correct. The College of Arts and Sciences is made up of three schools and has 23 departments, so you're sure to find the right major for you. The School of Natural Sciences and Mathematics has majors such as Biology, Chemistry, and Physics. The School of Social Sciences has majors such as Anthropology, Mass Communications, and Psychology. The School of Humanities has majors such as English, Philosophy, and Religious Studies. So how do I let the university know which major I picked? At orientation, you will be guided through the process of declaring your major as well as signing up for classes. Your academic advisor will be there to help you. Great. Is there anything that I'll need that'll help the registration process move more smoothly? Yes. AP, IB, and dual enrollment courses may satisfy some general education requirements, so make sure you have all your paperwork. Thanks, Siri. Now what do I do if I have more questions about my classes after orientation is over? You can schedule an appointment with your academic advisor. Here is a link to help you get there. I appreciate all the help I've had from you today, Siri. I don't know what I would have done without you. No problem. I aim to please.